Hey everyone, we are back with April's Loot Gaming Crate. The month theme was Hunt, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty positive that's right. Uh, the box itself, if you remember March's Loot Gaming, um, that was more square and a little bigger. This is pretty thin, pretty thin, kind of small. If you shake it, can hear something moving around in there. Sounds like something small. Maybe the pin could be the pin. Um, I'm really looking forward to the Dark Souls item in this. I believe another game in here is Far Cry 5, and I forget the others. But uh, I have high hopes. I'm really excited. I loved the first gaming crate I got, so let's see what's in it. Cheating, cheating. With my fingers in it, I feel some cloth. I was like, there's probably not a shirt in here. There's, there's some type of, there's some type of something in there. First thing we see is, oh, I don't know. You guys see it before I do. Is there anything cool? What's it look like? I'm peeking out the side. See some stuff. I see a lot of gray, a lot of black, a lot of dark colors. It's gonna go great with my Easter attire, all the pastel. This is the Dark Souls item. Uh, I can tell because it says Dark Souls 3 in sizable black letters on the back. That's cool. I don't hate it. I don't love it. Uh, I was hoping for something more. I actually uh, recently got a custom made banner of Dark Souls that came out really well. Uh, I'll see if I can throw a picture up of that. Um, and I needed a really high definition picture to do it with. And a lot of them, a lot of the pictures that come up are, are this picture, which isn't necessarily, you know, I'm, I'm screwing everything up, it's folding everywhere. Um, it's not necessarily a bad picture, it's just, it's, it's, the, it's the cover of the game. It's really uh, overused, I think. Um, and I think there's so many neat aspects of that game that they could have turned into a shirt. But again, um, I'm definitely going to wear it. feels really nice. I just wish it was a little bit cooler. Wish it was a little bit cooler. But still fairly pumped about it. All right, next thing. Is this a fanny pack? Hope County? All right. Some Hope County. Far Cry 5. I almost bought this game. I didn't. Is there anything in here? That'd be neat if they hit something really cool in here. Uh, nope. Um, I can say with a fair amount. Oh, little front pouch. Little front pouch. Um, I can say with a fair amount of confidence, I'm not going to use this. <laughs> um, nothing against Far Cry 5, even if they took a game I really like, like Dark Souls, like World of Warcraft, like Hearthstone, and they just gave me like a bag, um, just to hold little things in. Um, I mean, it's whatever, I guess. Uh, I recently bought a Halo ammo crate, like big tin to keep my, you know, knickknacks and whatever in. Um, so this, it's a little late, um, but you know, it's it's a little bag. If you need a little bag, here you go. Hope County it up. All right, next item on the docket. Box of chocolates, no. Chocolat with Johnny Depp. The Jawblade replica, that's pretty cool. All right, here it is. Let's open it up very gingerly, because let me tell you, it doesn't feel super resilient. Here we go. The unveiling. I played, oh, here it is in the plastic. Comes with a little stand. Um, I played Monster Hunter for a little bit, not a ton. I was a dual wielding guy myself. I thought that was super neat. It was really enjoyable to play that way. The other weapons were, you know, they were okay. Um, so this is kind of neat. I can put this with the Kratos shield statue uh, from the DX crate 
and I can put it with the, I believe, Captain Flameheart statue from uh, the March Loot Gaming Crate. So, I mean, there's definitely a lot of worse things this could have been. So, I'm kind of okay with it. Uh, can always put it in. Hope County, my Hope County almost fanny pack. All right. This, ooh, we're getting to the bottom. Oh, goodness. All right, let's see here. It looks like I have high hopes for this. Let's check out this pin. What? That's, look at this pin. Can we get a focus? Focus, focus. Look at that pin. It's like a bear trap. It's a bloody bear trap. Which, I mean, whoop. Oh. Bloody bear trap pin. Which makes sense, you know, the hunt theme. That's a cool pin. This might be my favorite pin uh, out of any pin I've received from Loot Crate. Um, I didn't love the Sea of Thieves one. I also don't play Sea of Thieves, so that might be it. Uh, the Buffy the Vampire Slayer one, that was pretty funny. This, I think this, this is definitely the coolest one I've got. This is super neat. Let's take a quick gander at this poster slash, okay. Here's the Far Cry poster. I'm pretty sure that's just the, uh, the cover of the game, right? Yeah, here we go. Last but not least, Looks like a Batman comic. Uh, Batman Arkham City comic. Let me see. The lead into the best selling video game. Okay, prequel to the game. Give you a close up of the art. Harley, scroll down. There's the Joker, naturally. Iconic duo. Big guns himself. This is pretty cool. Um, I don't think I'm going to open it. Um, I think I'm going to keep it right where it is. I have some other comics that when we finish the game room, I'm just going to kind of like line them up. And I'm hoping it's pretty cool. Um, and that is the end of the box. End of the box. Um, overall, the box was okay. Um, I like the shirt. I like the pen. I like the poster, I like the comic, I don't, I like the the replica model, Jawblade, uh, the almost fanny pack I don't really care about. Um, I don't love anything in the box, and only have one thing I'm fairly indifferent to slightly disliking, uh, be in the pouch. Overall I'd say um, not really bad as far as a favorite item. I mean, I'm gonna get most use out of the shirt. I think comic has, you know, if I decide to open it and read it, has the potential to be the coolest thing. Um, the pin though, the the trap pin with bacon in it, I think is awesome. Um, as comparing it to March's game crate, March's game crate was really cool. I liked it. Um, plus, I might be biased because it had some of my favorite games in it. Plus, it was my first one ever. So, but for a second gaming crate, uh, certainly not bad. You know, I don't regret getting it, and I look forward to the next one. Let me know what you guys thought of the box. Let me know if you got it. Let me know your favorite item, your least favorite item, and I will see you next time.